Hi, my name is Kelly. Welcome back to See Winter Baby Design. On today's episode, I will be making the ear savers. As many of you guys know, my sister, she works at a nursing home. So I had made her some face masks a couple of weeks back. So what I'm gonna do is show you guys how to make ear savers. So I went to my local Dollar Tree and find three items that you can use for the ear savers. So the first item, the first two items are the one inch binders. They have them in the school section at the Dollar Tree. So I picked these two colors. I thought it was cool how the colors and the design is. Good. You would need a sharp pair of scissors to cut the binder. Make sure you cut along the fold. To find the image of the ear savers, go into the search tool under my project and type in ear savers. Make sure to take your time when you pull the ear savers off the mat. The chopping mat did not work as planned, so make sure you just find one inch binders. This what happened to the chopping mat. It did not cut through the plastic because it was too thick. I came up with the idea to use the rotary blade to cut the piece of fabric to lay on the ear savers. I'm using the fabric glue. You can use E6000. I do not recommend hot glue because it will melt the ear saver.
I'm adding gems to the ear savers. So I'm using the same fabric glue and placing the gems on top of the glue. Make sure you don't put too much glue on the gem. So we're finished. So I'm going to go over what I use to complete this project. I use the leftover fabric I have for making the face mask, the Michigan print. The second one I had used the look like rhinestone gems. The third ear savers, I use the half a pearl gem gray and the last and final I use the whole pearl for the ear savers the small ear savers so for the fabric that I put on the ear savers I use the um, fabric glue you can't use E6000 I recommend not to use hot glue because hot glue will melt the plastic I didn't even try to use it I knew that hot glue would melt it, so I just went and used fabric glue to put the fabric on. But for like the last one, I used E6000 for the pearls. So I just, so what I did with the E6000, placed the E6000 onto the plastic and laid the pearls on top of the glue. I used, the, like I said, fabric glue for these two for the gems. So. Thank you for watching. Let me know down below what you think of this DIY project. Oh, before I go, let me show you the ones that's playing. So this is the small one that's playing. This is a medium size one. And this is the large. So if you do it with the binder, you probably get about 25 on each side. So that's like 50 her binder if you know how to line it up right so what I will be doing is giving these away to Dollar Tree once I give them their face mask so I'll be handing them out to Dollar Tree and giving us and giving a quite a few to my sister so she could pass it out to her co-workers if you have any questions feel free to comment down below thank you and have a nice day and be safe out there